all right, well, welcome back to my Let's Replay of Kirby Superstar, oh, Kirby Superstar, not Kirby Superstar Ultra. In the last part, we got through the first area, we got most of the chests in the first area, which is surprising, except for one. And now we get to fight the whale! Ah, uh, yes, the whale. The whale! It is a whale, and it is whale that, that abides by the rules of Mode 7. I should've got a partner. I should've done that. I should've got a partner. The Wild! I'm trying to remember when the hell I started saying The Wild! Oh wait, I think I think I remember when I said it because it could have something. No, I should have explained what when I first said it in another video. That was during a stream. Not forgetting how I remember it. Oh, I think it was because of Lady Crystal when she was playing Tales of Elementia and she said the Beluga Whale. Yeah, that's why. The bosses in this game range from evil to cheap asses to cheap asses to cheap asses to cheap asses. Most of the bosses in this in this one game, it's mostly this game are cheap asses, and I hate cheap asses. I hate cheap asses. Cheap asses are not my friend. I just suck at these bosses. For some reason, these bosses are kind of harder than most Kirby game bosses. For some unknown reason. And I can't put my finger on it. Why? I can't really put my finger on it. Why? They just are. And I guess that's because the rock hit me. Come on, kill the whale. The whale is dead. Bye bye, whale. Bye bye, Willy. That was a reference to my childhood. <laughs> yeah, funny thing is, like when I first saw Free Willy, I was a little kid, and I and I was always an active little kid. And, I, and we left the movie theater. I was like, bye bye, Willy. When we left the movie theater, like halfway through the picture, and my mom loves to quote that to this day. And I never quote that in my LPs, but it's time to quote now. I was like, when I was like three. I don't know. I was a young tyke back in the day. And now it's time to go through Dragon Quest Land. I first played Dragon Quest Land because the music sounds like Dragon Quest music for some odd reason. It just does. Here's the save point. We have three paths we can go through. So let's choose a path and, and go through. Uh, I think this. Isn't this the one I don't know how to get to? No, I, no, this is the one I know how to get to. Oh, no, I'm thinking of another one. The Goblet of Fire. Oh my god, Middle Gear. The Goblet of Fire has come again. Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. Yeah, I hope Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince is pretty good. I hope it's good. I have not seen, um... No, I mean Deathly Hallows. Did I see Deathly Hallows and Half-Blood Prince? I meant Deathly Hallows, by the way. Part 1 of Deathly Hallows. Yes, it's gonna be two movies. For those that don't know, and yes, for those that care, I am a Harry Potter fan. For those that actually care, I am a Harry Potter fan. And I have not seen Half-Blood Prince yet. I did hear that it was not that good because the ending was sort of cut out. They cut out most of the ending. That's mostly why the movie wasn't that great. That's, that's from what I've heard. I haven't seen it myself, so I don't know from personal personal experience. But that's all, I've, all, I, all I really know. And plus, people can play it's a love story. Duh, I read the book again. It is supposed to be a love story. I read the damn book. It's supposed to be a love story. It's not Twilight. Oh my god, I love her hair. Oh my god, so perfect. No. It's not like that. No, we're good. We're cashing up the g gold here. Yeah, but, yeah. Deathly Hallows might be pretty good. Except I hope... I, I don't know why. I just want them to cut... I'm always pissed off when they cut a lot of stuff out of those movies. Yeah, Deathly Hallows, I think they should cut like, like half of it out. Because most of the first half of the book is them in the woods. That's why I'm thinking they should cut like most of it out. That's just me, though. I know Piro's like, no, the, the wood stuff is important for, to the plot. Well, then, that's your business. I don't think I've ever been this way. I'm just exploring now. I'm, I'm, I'm just looking at areas I've never been to before. I have not been here before. How these just I never gotten before? Damn. I think this, this update is going to be two videos. I'm pretty sure it's just going to be two. I am pretty sure. Oh, look, I got to the boss already. So I go back and let's go back and go to the third door. Let's go back and backtrack. Backtracking. Backtracking, backtracking, backtracking. Let's go backtrack to the other door. 
Give me back my thing, you fucking bitch. You ninja, you are dead. That thing was a ninja. I called it. It was ninja. I said it's ninja. It had cat ears. It's what I speak ninja. Oh my god. It's ninja. Die, ninja. I don't like you, ninja. Get away from me, ninja. Die, ninja. Oh, there's also. Oh, there. I, oh, good thing I backtracked. There's another chest over here. I think I have backtrack. It's not gonna be 100 percent walk through, I'm gonna get at least most of the chests I can. I also wanna go through go through this door because I want cause I missed a chest. Oh wait. Did I go through the right door or the left door? Middle door. Ah, here we go. Uh, no wait, this is the one I don't wanna get. No wait, maybe I maybe I can, maybe I just never got to it because I never understood how I get to it. Maybe I can get to it if I go through this way. I don't think I ever went this way. Come on, let's get that chest. Let's do much better than we did in the original LP. In terms of chest quality. No. I want the chest. I want the, the chest. Thank you. This LP might be pretty long because I'm just looking for all the chests. Motherfucker die! Die, motherfucker die, motherfucker die! Hmm. Moving platforms. Death. Death. Death from above. Like I've never seen that before in my life. Nope. Never seen this kill spikes before in my life. Nope. They don't exist. They are myths. It was called Mythbusters on this on this case. Nah, I'm just kidding. God, we always call the Mythbusters on this case at once. Am I even going the right way? Okay, now we're gonna get to it. Okay, we're gonna get that chest I never gotten before. Get the chest! There we go! $100 coin. It must be Japanese. $100 coin, they must be Japanese or something. Well, I'm gonna pause it here and meet you back at the boss door. If it'll let me do it. Yes, I lost Cutter, but we're gonna get another ability anyway. Let's get Fighter. Let's, uh... Let's get two Fighters. Fine, you can be Bird if you want. Fine, be a Bird. The Bird, Bird, Bird. The Bird's a word. Okay. Is this what I think it is? Oh, yes, the first RPG mini boss. The second one sucks ass. But that's another game. The first of many RPG mini bosses. You suck. It's real time combat! Yeah, partner, just hit the other side of the screen, why don't you? Let's hit him! Let's do this! It's sleeping, oh my god. Oh, I almost killed him too. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you and all that you stand for. Fuck you and all that you stand no. We're not getting hit. Yeah, you hit you hit the bird. The bird, 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 the bird's the word. Hit the bird, that's the word. Now we're gonna fight the marionette. Or dancing doll. Whatever you wanna call it. Dancing dolls run around. She spin me right round. Alright. Dancing doll, are you ready to die? Dancing doll sleeping, oh my god. Uh, dancing doll, are you ready to be defeated? Dude? Yeah, you hit you hit the bird. The bird's the word. Die! Alright. Now we gotta fight human Kamek. Which isn't a nice, nice, nice person. Fuck you! Human Kamek is an evil bitch. And she must be defeated. Dude. Oh well, that was nice. That was nice. That was all nice and dory dory dory. I spell new! Fire spell new! My own fire betrays me now! Alright. We're gonna finish this boss off in the next part. See you guys next part. We finish off this fight and continue more of Great K Offensive. See you around, guys. Bye.